Ode to the Sorrow of Palestine, a lament in iambic pentameter. In lands where ancient olives grow beneath the sun's relentless glow, there lies a tale of endless woe, of Palestine where tears do flow. In every street, in every home, where children's laughter once did roam, now lingers a silent moan, a people's pain largely unknown. From hills of green to shores of blue, a land where ancient prophets knew, now echoes with a somber hue, a tale of suffering ever true. In distant lands where freedom rings, where liberty in anthem sings, there lies a tale of puppet strings, of policies with painful stings. For in America's grand halls, where justice claims to serve all calls, there lies a shadow that appalls, a funding of another's falls with every dollar every cent in aid in arms that's sent a message of consent is lent to conflict's brutal harsh event oh how can we who freedom boasts ignore the cries from coast to coast of those who need our help the most in palestine a haunted host we speak of rights of liberty yet close our eyes refuse to see the pain inflicted by decree in lands where living's not free o oh, palestine your children weep in rubble where your memories sleep your history so rich and deep now Scarred by wounds so raw, so steep. Yet amidst the bombs, the fear, the strife, the indomitable will of life persists, endures through endless strife, a testament to human life. From Gaza shores to West Bank's hills, despite the world's political ills, your spirit like undying wills inspires those who seek no frills. America, a oh, land so grand. Take a moment, understand, the power held in your hand to bring peace to this troubled land. For in each action, word and deed, lies the power to plant a seed of justice, peace, a future freed from love's, from hatred's vile, consuming greed. May this code and rhythmic plea, a call for empathy and equity, unite us in a common key to see the world where all are free. In closing, let this poem be a voice for those we seldom see, for Palestine in her plea for dignity and sovereignty.